Ashley here, and here's what's news. The Google Mobile website now has a built-in Places function that acts very similarly to the application. Icons appear below the search bar, which are labeled with nearby places, such as restaurants, coffee, bars. Google incorporated the new feature due to the increased activity on the mobile site when searching for places near whatever. If you're looking for something else, the More button included also gives you the freedom to search for a large variety of things, such as fast food, shops, ATMs, gas stations, and various other local attractions. Just yesterday, the HTC Desire's Facebook page filled its customers in that bringing gingerbread to the phone was basically impossible. They stated that there just wasn't enough memory for the 2.3 update without taking away from HTC Sense, which they explained would not be happening. Well, surprise! Today, HTC retracted the comment and assured us that now the Android 2.3 update will be available for the HTC Desire eventually. Either they've magically discovered a new solution, or plan on cutting the HTC Sense, something they just refused to do yesterday. Well, it looks like Lenovo will finally be releasing a tablet in the U.S., or tablets, I should say. They'll have two 10-inch Android tablets coming out this summer. The two tabs will have two separate target audiences, business and consumers. The average consumer's tablet, named IdeaPad, will most likely arrive this July and be followed by the business-minded ThinkPad. Both tablets will have 10-inch displays and run Android Honeycomb. Price can range between $450 to $900. Well, that's all for today. Make sure you follow us and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And don't forget to accessorize your phone in our Android accessory store. See you next time.